welcome back to my channel and today we're going to be doing a get ready with me with this look that I have come up with. Um, I'm headed to go get some coffee with a girlfriend so something that can transition me into work so via this um, but this video is going to be a get ready with me introducing you to a lot of products that I've been loving as well as a life update, fun story times, stuff like that. So grab a snack, enjoy your time with me and let's go ahead and get started. Alrighty, good morning everybody, good morning, good evening, wherever you are, it is morning time for me, I just woke up, I have my coffee, boop, and we're just going to get ready. We're going to get ready, I have some story times, I want to share with you guys some new products that I've been really loving, some that I purchased, some that have been uh, graciously gifted to me via my work. Yeah, so this is basically going to be um, get ready with me. I'm actually going to a coffee breakfast date, so um, this is going to be kind of like a soft glam. This has this look has to go to work too, so just like a soft glam featuring some new products that I've been loving, um, as well as a life update, um, what's been going on. Um, yeah, so let's get into it, guys. All right, guys, so I tilted you down a bit. I am still in my jammies, so um, like I said, just woke up. Um, we really wanted to get some content out for you guys, so... Here it is. Um, so the first product I used uh, washing my face was my Brie Essentials Natural Rose Hip Cleanser. You guys know this is my cult favorite. This is my uh, go-to morning cleanser. Then we're gonna follow up with the Derma E Essentials Radiance Toner. This is another. This is their like essentials in their um, product line. And then I've been really liking this for like my acne marks um, as well as just radiance and exfoliation. Um, I would be using the Herbal Astringent Toner, whoa, but, um, it's empty, so, can't use that one today. But, what has been going on, guys? Um, it, as if most of you don't already know, I am a January baby. My birthday is January 9th. I am a Capricorn. <laughs> we are into February, so I am the year of the ox. I am not the year of the pig, if you are the year of the pig. Um, that's awesome. A uh, happy lunar what is it? Happy Chinese New Year? I love all the decorations. They're super cute. But anywho, um, yes, January is my birthday month, okay? Um, as a kid, you get a birthday. Um, then you get a little bit older, then it's a birthday week, and now I'm a full-fledged adult, so it is a birthday month. So I definitely had um, a lot... Um, a lot going on, which is great. You gotta spoil yourself. You gotta treat yourself. Um, so... New Year's rolled around, um, I got sick. So I got sick the 30th and the 31st. Um, I had a head cold and an ear infection that literally woke me up from my sleep. So that wasn't fun. So the 30th, I went into urgent care. Luckily, I am blessed with really good um, insurance. So they got me in, they got me out, I got medicine. Um, they got me medicine and I was, you know, healed in a couple days. Took the rest of the week off from work to go ahead and heal. And um, one of me and my friend, we went to um, Big Bear and we had a really, really good time. Um, it's beautiful weather up there. Luckily, I do live close to Big Bear, so that was really fun. Really, really fun. Um, I kind of want to insert some, like, goofy photos. We'll, we'll see. I, like, wore, um... Right before we went to Big Bear, we went to, oh, I can insert, yeah, I'll insert, like, um, I went to the plant, plant-powered fast food joint. There's one in Redlands, Encinitas, San Diego, and then there's gonna be one in my Pacifica, sorry guys, Pacifica Rosewater Lip Balm. And it was delicious. I got a chicken sandwich, a fried chicken sandwich with french fries and their featured shake of the month was cookies and cream. And my friend really enjoyed it and it was, um, yeah, it was so good. And fun fact, there was this, um, the, the, the lady who took her order was super sweet and um, she was letting us know that someone drives like over an hour and a half like just to get to work. I'm like, that's a dedication for um, a vegan, a uh, fully vegan restaurant. My dog is in here, sorry, he wants to be featured, but not yet, not yet, little one. Um, so yeah, that was, it was absolutely amazing, and it was so, so good. It's worth the money to me, a lot of people are, I feel like, turned off by the price, but, um, it was absolutely amazing, and I can't wait for the one in Long Beach, because, um, that's a little bit closer, kind of, sort of. I feel like it's worth the drive, because 
um, milk cooling stick. It's worth a drive because you can go to the beach and I don't know. I feel like in Redlands there's not much to do but go to the mountains. So luckily right before we went up to the mountains we went there. So that was like killing two birds with one stone. Yeah, so first week we did Big Bear. That was really fun. Um, and then what else? The second week was my birthday, so Monday, I think, what did I do? I don't even remember. The 7th, I don't really remember, but then the 8th, um, I had work, I closed at work, so like, I got myself Chipotle, and like, I got to work really early, and um, my boss is awesome, she got me, if you guys follow me on Instagram, which you should, I've been posting every single day um, since January 1st, um, the new year, so make sure you're, you're following me on there, life is Abby underscore 97, um, and she bought me a vegan cinnamon roll happy birthday cinnamon roll um she put our photo on the wall and we were all celebrated all the capricorns and aquarius um which is really cool i thought that was really special because literally no other boss i've ever had has done that for me so that was really cool that was um that was really nice to kind of see that um love and like appreciation for her workers her employees um to be to be loved and to be appreciated like that that was really awesome um, next step, let's go to, um, serum, um, my tried and true serum, e. actually I'm going to do this one just because I'm wearing makeup today, but this one is the Moon Juice Beauty Shroom, I know you could do it little one, you guys can see that, yeah, <laughs> sorry guys, um, I don't want to bore you with the zooming in and zooming out, and I'll have my editor, um, zoom, uh, fast forward some stuff so I don't bore you to death. But this is the um, plumping jelly serum from Moon Juice. We had a beautiful vendor come in and kind of educate us on um, this product and the brand itself. And it is a uh, almost fully vegan um, supplement. And they have a few beauty products on their website, and this is one of them. And this serum is really nice. It's very calming to the skin plumping, hydrating, has hyaluronic acid in it, and I feel like it really plays well under makeup. It kind of is like a primer in a sense, but um, I really, really like it. It works, like I said, it works really well under makeup. Um, it does have a really nice jelly texture, um, so I really only use it in the mornings, like if I wear makeup, just because it does help with that plumping, hydrating um, effect, and I really, really like it. It makes your skin feel really soft. Anyway, Boss is awesome. Um, she got me, like I said, vegan um, cinnamon roll. And then, yeah, so Wednesday was my birthday. So I am 22 years old this year. And me and my mom had a wonderful, wonderful... Sorry, I don't know why my dog's barking, guys. He has food, he has water. Um, I need to film. Um, but it was awesome. I had a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful day. Um got up pretty early, um, there is a brunch place by my, a new brunch place by my house called Squeeze, Squeeze In, I was going to say Squeeze Me, I feel like it should be Squeeze Me, I don't know, but, um, super, super nice brunch, I got my free Starbucks, um, brunch was really nice, um, really expensive, would I go there again? Probably not, but, um, me and my mom had a really good time, eye cream, new eye cream, uh, from my kin, Kinder Beauty Box. I want to say Kinder, but I believe it's Kinder. Um, Kinder Beauty Box, which is the 100% pure coffee bean caffeine eye cream. Um, yeah, the brunch was... I think the squeeze-in squeeze place originated in um, Reno, Nevada. And my mom's like, oh my gosh, like I'm from there. And um, we were chatting up the waiter. And, um, and then he was letting us know that like where I live because I'm a Dodger fan, that one of my favorite catchers, Austin Barnes, lives in the apartment complex near there, and I was like, there is no way. There's no way. There's no way that he would make the travel. No, there's just, there's no way. And then he said him and his girlfriend. Meanwhile, him and his girlfriend, his fiance, are married, so I think he was just faking it. And then he's like, oh yeah, Chad Billingsley's been here, and I'm like, I didn't believe it. I was like, nah. Um, but we had um, nice mimosas. The food was delicious. And then we made our journey all the way to uh, Pechanga. 
really early and our plans were to gamble for about a couple hours and then leave. We didn't want to be stuck in any traffic. The I think it's the 15 you take over there, 15 or the, not the 10, the 15. Um, and we wanted to leave early. So here's kind of when like the main story time comes in. I really wanted to, um, I'm very humble about my winnings. Um, and I just think it's really exciting. I think it's really exciting. Um, my 21st birthday, um, I did not win anything. So this is definitely a redemption. So anyway, we get to Pechanga. It's very calm. My birthday is on a Wednesday. So there's just like the locals there. Um, you know, a couple travelers. But mostly the locals with like their little cards and stuff. Um, let's see what else I'm going to do. Just moisturizer. And then we're going to try SPF I was gifted at work. So I'm going to do, yeah, I'm going to do this moisturizer. I've been really liking this one. Okay, cool beans. So, I'm sorry guys, let's do moisturizer first, and then we'll we'll, we'll move into the story time. Um, so this is the newest guy from, I really want you guys to see this. So this is the newest guy from First Aid Beauty. Sorry guys, sometimes my camera wants to cooperate, most of the days it doesn't. Um, this is the Ultra Repair Berry Air Cream. So their main goal with this one, or the main emphasis is the word air. So it's a super lightweight texture. And of course I'm going to link everything. But this product's main goal is kind of an all-in-one and it's only 30 bucks. Which is like a steal. It really is like a complete steal. Um, from First Aid Beauty Fab Cosmetics. Um... Um, I didn't think I would like it, but I was doing a little bit more research. This is vegan, which is amazing. Um, it feels super, super lightweight, but I, I put a lot on. Like, I don't really think that you need, but a little bit goes a long way. But this has hyaluronic acid in it. It's going to help protect you from the environment. I always say this at work. I'm like, yeah, you ever wake up and see that beautiful um, yellow haze that's above us? Uh, yeah, that's on our skin. So that's what this guy is. Always bring it down to the neck. Um, but yeah, 30 bucks, um, you get a really nice tub. I think I'm definitely going to go ahead and repurchase this once this is empty because I really, really like it. But this is a new launch at Sephora. Um, but yeah, I really, really like it. It works really well. Okay. I'm going to give that a second, and then I'm going to put sunscreen on, and then we're going to get into the fun part, which is the makeup. Um, but anyway, guys, so yeah, it was really cool, and um, kind of side story, I'm very into, not like superstitious in any way, but like, you know, when like things happen, you're like, oh my god, like that's good juju, like that, that is a good sign, or if something, like if something breaks, or you know, if you like headed somewhere and something happens you're like oh my god that's bad juju like we shouldn't do that so uh the morning of my dad gave me um 22 dollars and a uh year of the pig um scratcher you can get it like um say target you can get at like a, gro a gas station or something and um me and my friend in Big Bear had previously done those, and we won like a dollar, a ticket, whatever, but we won four dollars off a dollar scratcher, so it was like, you know, we were like, oh my god, like, this is a good sign, like, this means we're gonna have a good day, like, you might win something, not, you know, not a gazillion dollars, but you might win something. So, you know, um, I left that there with some money that my dad gave me and my mom gave me, and I took um, a little bit with me just to gamble with. So anyway, like I said, we get there, and then there's like this really cute You're the Pig um, display out in front. I take a picture with a little piggy, and I have my fanny pack going on, and of course, I'm going to insert pictures and stuff like that um, while I'm talking, just because so it gives you something to get, give you guys a visual. So then, um, yes, yes, yes. So um, I still have my Starbucks. Um, I'm not in the mood to drink yet or anything. And um, we kind of start warming up, me and my mom, on um, do uh, dollar machines. She's freaking hitting it big, right? She is hitting it big. She wins about $300 on one. She hops off, puts like I don't know, maybe 15 bucks in the in the machine. She takes out her ticket, puts it back in or whatever, and then she wins $400. We literally are not even getting comfy. Like, we barely get there. I still have my Starbucks. And I'm like, what the frick? So I'm getting nervous. I'm like, oh my god, am I going to win? Like, what's going on? I won about, I would think I won like 50 bucks off the dollar machine. So that was really, really, really exciting. I was like, oh my god. 
So then we start walking around. I do like, um, I love fish. You guys know that like um, aqu aquarium and like ocean type things are definitely my deal. I'm going to be putting on, um, this is the um, Umbra Tinted Physical Daily Defense. Wait, I don't know if this one's vegan. Okay guys, so um, luckily I researched this before I put it on my face. This is not vegan. This is the um, Drunk Elephant Umbra Tinte Physical Daily Defense SPF. Um, this has seashells in it, so that's kind of gross. Um, Drunk Elephant, what is wrong with you? They have a lot of vegan options though. Um, one of my favorite um, serums is vegan from them so that's a little disappointing but we're going to be using um Brie Essentials sunscreen um kind of going to be in the sun and you just got to want to protect yourself um it's really disappointing but anyway so my mom is winning and I'm getting nervous and luckily there's like not a lot of people there there's not a lot of commotion chaos going around um, so, you know, we get there, and, yeah, so she's winning, and I go to, like, a fish, um, penny machine, and I think I'm winning, but, like, with those, you, like, really never know if you're winning. Um, so, yeah, like, I was just getting really, really nervous. I lost, um, $20 on a penny machine, and then... What else? Oh, and then I was getting a bunch of birthday messages and birthday calls. So my mom, we were just walking around kind of trying to find a spot to like sit down and continue to gamble. Um, and then what else? What else? We were trying to find some more dollar machines, but we couldn't find any. So then I sat down on like this Panther penny machine and I lost like $20 again. I was like, this is ridiculous. I hate these things. So then um, what else? What else? What else? Yeah, so, um, what else? Uh, oh, okay, okay, so we're walking around. So I lost about $40 on these stupid penny machines. So then me and my mom are walking around, um, and then we finally find quarter machines. So there's six of them, three on each side. Um, it's double, uh, double, not double sided, but like three on one side, three on the other. So then we finally sit down and I win $104 on a quarter machine. And you always want to be mindful about the lines that it picks because sometimes it'll max you out but there's only one line. Those are probably the hardest to um, win off of because it's only one line that you're, that you're able to um, win off of. So I went on this one machine and I got $104 and my mom, I think she got like maybe 70 bucks or something like that. So we're like, okay, let's take a break. Let's go ahead and go grab a drink, relax, and um, then we'll go ahead and cash out our winnings and play a little bit more and then that's it, right? So um, we get, I think, like I said, I think it's lucky I get a blue moon. And me and my mom are just relaxing. We have our waters and we're just relaxing and kind of just taking in the atmosphere. Um, and it was just really nice. And I was really excited. I was up 50 bucks, right? I brought $100. I had a little bit to play with. Um, but I was basically up 50 bucks. 50 bucks and some change. So other than that, I was happy. Like, you know, won some, lost some. As long as you're breaking even or, or winning a little bit more, then you're totally fine. So I wasn't mad or upset or anything. I was just having a really good day. We had planned after to go get some food and to go shopping. Um, so I was, I was, I was, you know, having a really, really good time. So, um. Um, before I get into the makeup, I want to finish my story, but, um, yeah, so, um, then we go back to the penny machines, right? So this is when it gets really exciting, guys, okay? So this is basically the end of the story, and then I can talk more about whatever, um, while I get my makeup on, but, um, so, we go back to the, 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 pe the quarter machines, excuse me. And we see this, you know, this older gentleman sitting there, and we kind of want to give him his space. So we go to the other side, and I put in, um, I think I put in my, I put in a 20, and I'm like losing it, losing it, losing it. And I'm like, okay, I think we should just walk away. So then I hop onto the next one, and I'm losing, losing. Uh, so then we go on the other side, right? So then I start winning on this one machine, and um, so I'm like, okay, you know, getting a little comfortable. It starts, you know, do -do 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 and it just is very exciting. If you've never gambled, just try it. Some like it, some don't. Um, so then, anyway, um, so then, we're, like I said, I wanted to give this gentleman some space. I feel like he's like a regular, so, but, 
you know, whatever, you know, it, it's a community thing, whatever. So then my mom wants to hop onto the next one next to this gentleman. And I'm like, no, get out of my way. You've already won too much money. So I literally like scoot into her seat. I put my drink down. Literally, guys, literally, literally, $2.50. I put in this machine $2.50. $2.50. One spin, no go. Two spins, no go. Three spins, meaning like I put the max, boop, 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 the max, five lines, and I hit the jackpot. I hit the jackpot on this quarter machine. And I wasn't like, I had, I was just your adrenaline's going and it's like, -lo -lo, like all these lights and these sounds and um, it was insane. And then the gentleman next to me, he's like, yeah, you just won the jackpot. And I'll, like I said, I'm going to try to find some pictures or send some pictures. Um, but it's like boom, boom, boom. And it was the highest one you can get. And it was um, 6,000 coins. And after all that, after everything, after the ladies came and assisted us, um, after, you know, everyone was congratulating me that was walking by, um, I had won $1,500. $1,500! It was absolutely insane. It was so, 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 so incredibly fun. Like, it was just like... I couldn't believe it. Like, it was crazy. It was so, 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 so fun and exciting. And um, it was definitely a great way to start the year. Definitely a great way to start off 22. Um, and it was really, really exciting. Um, long story short, before I put my makeup on, I just wanted to, like, to update you guys on stuff. Like, I feel like I, I wanted to share it with you guys because it's pretty exciting. And um, I find it, you know, kind of fun and, and whatnot. But, um, yeah, we, we won. We got our winnings. She handed me all the money in my hand, and it was really cute and sweet. Ladies were super sweet. They knew I was really nervous. They're like, make sure you clear out this machine, take your ticket, and, uh, you know, have a great day. And we were like, we're running out of here! We were not going to be dumb and put more money into any machines. Um... So we literally uh, cashed out the rest of our tickets. We, um, we, you know, we left and I had my fanny pack. I'm like, the fanny pack brought it home. And uh, we got lunch, we went shopping, and then me and my friend after we went to Dave and & Buster's and just had some drinks and relaxed and had a really good time. And uh, that day was like so, so, so cool. I could not stop. Um, laughing about it and smiling about it and being happy about it because it was really really special it was really cool a really cool memory that I got to spend with my mom um, and it was really nice and the the cool thing about it was um, it was like not even three checks from Sephora which is very unfortunate it like really was like wow puts in perspective but um, it was amazing it was an amazing amount of money because um, I had to buy a lot of stuff for school and you know for myself and to treat yourself and you win that money and you know you got to put a lot into it into savings and and to just kind of learn like hey you have a large sum of money don't be dumb be smart about it so that was um, definitely really cool definitely a story time that I wanted to share with you guys it was really cool definitely like I said a great way to start the year um, but yeah so it was really cool I'm gonna get my makeup stuff and we're gonna roll on into the makeup Alright guys, I'm back with the makeup. We're going to start with our eyes first. I um, hope you guys enjoyed that little story time. It's definitely an exciting thing and I'm very grateful and lucky to have won that money. I know that that doesn't happen every single day. Um, it was really, um, it was really exciting. Um, super fun. It was just like definitely out of the blue. Like we, Like I said, we were not expecting, me and my mom were not expecting anything. But when we did win that $4 in the morning, like right before we even left to go get breakfast or anything like that, it was like truly like, oh my gosh, like this is, this is awesome. You know, this is super cool. Kylo, don't kick my camera, please. That is so rude. Um, you know, we were, we were surprised. We were happy. Um, it was just like, oh my gosh, like such a, such a good, such a good birthday I was able to treat my mom to get some of her products and I bought some products and you know it's just like a great way to like 
I don't know, like enjoy your birthday, but um, really wanted to share that with you guys. Um, I thought it, it was, you know, something that, I don't know, it's my channel. Life is Abby underscore 97, so um, just kind of something to share with you guys. Um, like I said, January is my birthday, um, Urban Decay Primer Potion. Um, January is my birthday month, so, you know, I wanted to do a lot. Um, had a family party and shared it with my um, baby cousin Leo. He is January 19th. He is a Capricorn as well. Um, my grandma is born on the 19th as well. Um, and my dad took her to a basketball game, which was really nice. Oh, and then... Um, me and my dad went to the Kings game for my birthday. It was like it was Star Wars themed. It was super super fun. Um, such a fun day. Um, that was really nice. Um, I had never been to a hockey game before, so um, going to the Kings game was definitely um, an experience. It was a fun experience. I really really enjoyed it. Um, the Kings won like five to two. And we were playing the Pittsburgh Penguins, and oh my god, Pittsburgh, you are some shit talkers. Calm it down, boo-boo, because we won. We beat your ass. But, um, I'm going to be using um, a few colors from the e.l.f. Um, this is the Modern Metals palette. Um, and then, um, I'm just going to go ahead and speed through this so I don't bore you guys to death. Um, but, and, um, so I'm going to be using a few colors from here. I'll show you in the speed up, and then I'm going to be topping my lid off with a NYX, or excuse me, a nude stick in the color um, Rustic, and I'm going to be putting that on my lid. So I'm going to speed through this just so I don't bore you guys to death, um, so just uh, hang, hang tight. Alrighty, perfect guys. So eyes are done and then we're going to move on to the base. Um, like I said, modern metals as well as my nude sticks. Um, but yeah guys, so January was awesome. After, you know, I did King's Game, family party, um, I did a paint night which was fun. Um, you know, just got to hang out with my family and my friends. It was just really nice. Work was really good. I mean, we had a lot of hours, which was very surprising because it's, you know, if you're in the business world, we're in quarter one. Um, so, you know, most of the time there are no hours, but um, it's been really good. Um, so just like a really simple um, eye today, nothing too crazy. Like I said, I'm just going to a... Uh, breakfast-ish date and then I'm going to work later but um, my tried and true foundation right now is the wet n wild um, and then we're gonna be using my newfound love which is the Juno sponge I've been really liking this guy um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and at first and I hope you guys like I said make sure that you guys are following me on my insta because I did post about this guy um, at the beginning of the year. I absolutely hated it. And I think with like super matte foundations, this doesn't work the best. But, um, sorry guys, I have a mirror right here. Um, with super matte foundations, it's not like your best friend. But, um, I like it with this one. My Haley's one from Target, it doesn't really like the Juno sponge. You don't need a lot of product. Um, this sponge does not soak up any product, which is amazing. So, I really like it. It's only six bucks. I want to pick up, um, their, like, Valentine's Day ones, which are pink. I think they're super cute. But I miss you guys, and I want to be putting out more content. <coughs> Excuse me. Um... I do want to vlog. I know I've been really lazy on that. I did start school the 22nd of January, so I'm really um, trying to find my routine with that. 
It's been going really well so far. Me and one of my uh, friends that I made last semester, we've been going to the gym every Tuesday and Thursday. And I'm like, oh girl, we are going to be looking so good at the end of the semester. And um, that's definitely one of my New Year's resolutions is to just be more active. Um, my fitness goal is basically just to be toned. Um, I feel like that's just my main goal. I don't want to be like super muscly or super like anything like that. Um, and I don't have money for a personal trainer, which would be really nice, but that's definitely just not in the cards right now. But, uh, yeah, so we've been going to the gym, and school is pretty okay. Um, new guy, make sure you guys are following me on my Insta, I did post about this guy. New Elf 16 Hour Concealer. You have to blend, like, literally Shape Tape Hello. This is a Shape Tape dupe. Um, you have to work with this product very, very quickly. Blend her out, and then go ahead and, um, set it. Set it and forget it, girl. Um, I really like this formula. It is it is $5, which is out of this world affordable for most people as opposed, you know, to higher end stuff. I have been loving drugstore options. Um, this Wet n Wild foundation, duh, it is like a cult staple in the beauty in the beauty world. But yeah, so school's been good. I'm taking um, six classes two online and um, four um, at campus. One is a hybrid though, so I only go once a week, which is great. So I'm just trying to stay on top of school, but you know, still have a social life and really work on social media. Like I said, guys, I've been posting every single day, if you guys haven't noticed. That is um, one of my goals for um, 2019 is to post every single day. And I want to do like a week of videos where I just post like makeup, skincare, lifestyle videos. So I need to um, partner with my editor on that. Um, because, yeah, I feel like you guys do like those videos. Um, I want to do like nice edited ones and then I'll do like my crappy ones. <laughs> just where I'm like showing you like one step of something. But, um... So yeah, I really like this concealer, guys. But yeah, I've been, I've, I've just really just been kind of focusing on school right now. It is really important. I should be, knock on wood. Um, if everything goes well, I will be graduating in the summer. So I will be a summer school kid for one more, um, it's not even a semester, it's like half a semester. Kylo? Shh, quiet. Um, so like I said, if everything goes well there, then I should be out of there by summer, and hopefully um, I will be able to get a big girl job. Um, because, yeah, that's really important. I don't plan on going to grad school, if at all, right away. Um, yeah, I just don't. Kylo, what's wrong? Stop it. Stop crying. You're good. Um... So just loose, very, very lightly set this concealer. It does not need crazy amount of setting, which is really nice. And then I'm just going to go ahead and set the rest of my face. So I'm going to speed that up for you guys. Alrighty guys, so the powder is done. I've been using Kat Von D. Um, this is almost done, thank the Lord, because I really want to try the new milk one. But guys, this e.l.f. concealer, you need to get it. It's literally a Shape Tape dupe. Um, yeah, so you guys need it. You need it in your life. And the Juno sponge, I really recommend for super matte foundations. I really wouldn't. Um, for my Haley's one, I do have to use a beauty blender. So um, <clears throat> there's that, but it's really not much of a, much of a, you know, bad thing or whatever. So for brows, guys, my newfound love is the Milk Kush Fiber um, Brow Mascara. ColourPop, um, this is the Brow Boss Brow Pencil in Dark Brown. And then I go ahead and use my Milk Kush Fiber Brow Gel, and I've been really liking this combo. So I'm going to speed it up for you guys. I feel like the story time to ate up a lot of my time. But I'm just going to go ahead and fan out my brows. 
I'm going to fill in the tail with my brow pencil and then fill in the top and middle with the Kush um, fiber gel. So I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, so brows are on. We're going to finish some complexion um, and then that'll be it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, honestly. I just really wanted to get some content out to you guys. I'm texting my friend right now making sure we're still good. Um, but um, yeah, like I just really want to share with you guys some new products like my Juno sponge and my new Kush Brow Mascara um, that I've been truly, truly loving. But, um, yeah, I miss you guys. I know I've been MIA, but like I said, I've just really been enjoying my birthday month. Enjoying the time that I have with my friends and stuff like that and my family. So that's been really nice. So I'm going to speed up some complexion for you guys. Um, uh, butter bronzer, you guys know, is my fave. Um, I'm going to be using, uh, let me grab it really quickly. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm going to be grabbing, um, this is the blush I'm going to be using. This is the, um duo to the Modern Metals palette from e.l.f. and then I'm going to be using my tried and true highlighter from e.l.f. in the color um, Sunset Glow. So let's get this going. Alrighty guys, we are highlighted to the gods. Um, I love that highlight. It's just um, incredibly, incredibly pretty from e.l.f. I think that one's $6. You um, really can't beat that. So then the last step, I'm just making sure I'm not forgetting anything, is mascara. And I grabbed this little guy from work. We were having an hourglass event. And I'm not going to bother with eyeliner just because I just really don't want to. Which is the hourglass... Um, Caution Mascara and Ultra Black. This is a vegan formula and they are going they are cruelty free and they are planning to go vegan uh, fully vegan in 2020. So I was really excited to see and hear that. Um so I asked if I could um I made a purchase that day and then they were giving a TOA which is basically like a gift with purchase that day and my boss was like, "Yeah, go ahead and take it." And I will be repurchasing the full size. So it's a beautiful formula. This is kind of like a Tr um, triangle shaped um, wand and it just like really gives you beautiful length. This is just like the little itty bitty one but it is freaking gorgeous. It is like such a um, easy applicator to use. Even this little mini one is really easy to use. So I would highly recommend this mascara. So I curl my lashes, always curl my lashes. Um, e.l.f. The e.l.f. one is like $3, $2. But see, it's just like so pretty. Hey there. Do a little on the bottom. It's very natural, but like, I don't know, I feel like you could build it up a little bit. This formula does dry down really fast, so you do have to work with it really fast. So like if you're going to build up the formula, or build up the coats, do it like immediately like I'm doing right now. It dries down very quickly, which I like. I don't really like to have my... um mascara dry uh, take long anyway so I'm not mad about it. <laughs> I'm not mad at all. Alrighty guys so I'm gonna go ahead and get dressed do my hair and then we're gonna finish off with some setting spray and a lippy so I will be right back. 
Alrighty guys, so I just put on this like fuzzy sweater, some jeans and some boots, put a little oil in my hair, make sure I'm not a frizz, not a frizz mess, but I'm going to finish off with some ColourPop setting spray to my fan, so we're going to be like, oh, but yeah, so this one I've had for a while, I don't know which one to get next, I really want to get um, a refill on my cover effects one. Beyonce got nothing on me, just kidding. Um, but uh, I don't know what other ones. I kind of want to do the milk one, but it's like matte blur. I don't really want to be matte blur. I want to be like normal. <laughs> I mean, normal girl. I'm just kidding. But yeah, my hair is a little bit of a mess. I just like uh, washed it and then air dried it while I went to bed. But um, it, it is kind of a mess. But we're gonna, we're gonna. Um, we're just gonna get over it. You know what I mean? Know what I'm saying? Know what I'm saying? Um, I am probably gonna go shorter. Um, I was telling my girl who does my hair, I'm like, I love my hair, I'm gracious, I'm grateful for it, but I want it short. Nude stick, um, this is a lip and cheek pencil in the color blush. These are so easy. And I love them. It's like my go-to lip at work. Perfect. It's like a demi matte, and I always like to put um like a lip. Um, some chapstick underneath to um, give it a little moisture, give it a little life. But um, here is the um, finished look, guys. I hope you like it. Very simple. Um, showing you guys some new products that I've been loving. Update. Um, like I said, I do want to start vlogging. I just don't know when. Um, I'm probably just going to do it, you know, and just have one on the fly. Peter Mon is definitely my inspiration right now, so just like who gives an F and just do it, you know what I mean? So, um, thank you guys again for all the love and support. Thank you guys again for watching this video. Hope you had your snacks. Hope you got ready with me or, you know, went to bed with me. Like, I know that sounds weird, but, like, I always like to watch these videos before I go to bed. Um, I just, um, really appreciate the love and support, guys. Make sure you guys are following me on my Instagram. That's where I post often, as well as my Twitter. Life is Abby underscore 97. I am posting every single day, so definitely, um, be following me there. And if you guys ever have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments below. DM me. My email is on my um, um, Instagram, so if you feel most comfortable through that, by all means. But thank you guys again for all the love and support, and I will see you guys on my next video. Bye, guys!